Welcome students. Today we are going to learn divisibility rules for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 9 and 10. What is divisibility? Divisibility refers to a number is divided by another number without a remainder left over. So it is a divisibility. Divisible by it means when we divide one number by another the result is a whole number. For example 12 is divisible by 6. Why? Because 12 divided by 6 equals to 2. No remainder is there. Then 15 is divisible by 3 because 15 divided by 3 equals to 5. Same no remainder is there. But 16 is not divisible by 5. You know why? Because when we divide 16 by 5, question is 3, but remainder is 1. That's why 16 is not divisible by 5. A divisibility rule is a shortened way of determining whether a given number is divisible by a fixed divisor without performing the division usually by examining its digits. It means without doing the actual division, we can find out that any number is divisible by given number or not. Divisible by 1. Yes, every number is divisible by 1 in this universe. So it is very easy. 12 divided by 1 equals to 12. 434 divided by 1 equals to 434. It means every number is divisible by 1. Let us check divisibility rule for 2. If the number is even, that is the ones place digit is 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, then that number is divisible by 2. For example, here is the number 360. At first, we will underline what is at one's place. Yes, 0 is at one's place. So, 360 is divisible by 2. Let us take another example. 73,618. Just check what is, is at one's place. Yes, there is 8. And 8 is at one's place. So, 73,618 is divisible by 2. Divisibility rule for 3 and it is very easy. If the sum of the digits is divisible by 3, then that number is also divisible by 3. For example, 360. At first, we will find out the sum of the digits. It means 3 plus 6 plus 0 and that is equals to 9. And we know that 9 is divisible by 3. So, 360 is also divisible by 3. Let us take one more example, 12,345 and the digits, yes, we will find out the sum of the digits. It means 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 equals to 15 and we know that 15 is divisible by 3. So, 12,345 is also divisible by 3. Practice is very important. So, my dear students, check if the number is divisible by 3, 3,979. 6204. Do it in your notebook. Divisibility rule for 4. If the last two digits are divisible by 4, then that number is divisible by 4. For example, 360. Now, what are the last two digits? Yes, 6060. And we know that 60 divided by 4 equals to 15. It means 60 is fully divisible by 4. So, 360 is divisible by 4. Take one more example. 13,416. At first, find out what are the last two digits. And yes, the last two digits are 16. So, we can say that 16 divided by 4 equals to 4. It means 13,416 is divisible by 4. Divisibility rule for 5. If 0 and 5 is at one's place, always remember and it is very easy to uh, remember. 360. 0 is at one's place. So, 360 is divisible by 5. Take one more example. 5695. Here, 5 is at one's place. It means uh, 5695 is divisible by 5.
Now, my dear students, do practice. Check if the number is divisible by 5. The number is 2089. Divisibility rule for 6. If the number is divisible by 2 and 3, it means we have to test for 2 also and for 3 also. If it is divisible by both, then definitely it will be divisible by 6 also. For example, 360. At first, we will check for 2. To check, let us see what is it at once place. Yes, 0 is at once place. So, 360 is divisible by 2. Now, check for 3. 3 plus 6 plus 0, sum of the digits equals to 9. It means 9 divided by 3 equal to 3. So, 360 is divisible by 3. And because it is divisible by 2 and 3 both, that's why 360 is divisible by 6 also. Let us take one more example. 4236. At first, we will see that is it divisible by 2? Yes. 6 is at once place. So, 4236 is divisible by 2. Now, check for 3. 4 plus 2 plus 3 plus 6 according to the divisibility rule for 3 sum of the digits which is equals to 15 and we know that 15 divided by 3 equals to 5 15 is divisible by 3 so 4236 is divisible by 3 and because it is divisible by 2 and 3 both it is divisible by 6 also now my dear students Check if the number is divisible by 6 and the number is this 75391. Do it in your notebook. Let us check what is the divisibility rule for 8. If the last three digits are divisible by 8, very simple it is. For example, 13416. See what are the last three digits? 416. So let us check 416 is divisible by 8 or not. So 416 divided by 8 equal to 52. Yes, it is divisible by 8. So 13,416 is also divisible by 8. Let us take one more example. 32,900. What are the last three digits? 900. Now 900 divided by 8. Then question equal to 112 and remainder equal to 4. Yes, there is a remainder. It means 900 is not divisible by 8. Therefore, 32,900 is not divisible by 8. Very simple. Divisible by 9. How can we check if the sum of the digits is divisible by 9? 360. Take this example. And sum of the digits, 3 plus 6 plus 0 equals to 9. And we know that 9 divided by 9 equals to 1. 9 is divisible by 9. Therefore, 360 is divisible by 9. Take one more example. 68,709. Sum of the digits, yes, 6 plus 8 plus 7 plus 0 plus 9 equals to 30. And we know that 30 is not divisible by 9. Therefore, 68,709 is not divisible by 9. Practice makes you perfect. So, check if the number is divisible by 9. Numbers are 1 lakh 8 and 24 lakh 77,818. Do it in your notebook. Divisibility rule for 10. Yes, 0 is at once place. Very easy to find out. Let us take one example, 360. And we know that 0 is at once place. So, 360 is divisible by 10. Take one more example, 32,900. Here also, 0 is at once place. So, 32,900 is divisible by 10 is a quick recap of divisibility rules. A number is divisible by 2 if it ends in a 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8 or we can say it is an even number. For 3, if the sum of the digit is divisible by 3. For 4, if the last two digits are divisible by 4. For 5, if 0 and 5 is at once place. 
it means if the number ends in 0 or 5 very simple for 6 if the number is divisible by 2 and 3 for 8 if the last three digits are divisible by 8 and for 9 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 9 for 10 if the numbers ends in 0 yes it means 0 is at once place then it is divisible by 10 thanks a lot